I'm gonna get that sink out today. That's happening. I may have to put off the sink part until later. We are gonna move on to goal number two, which is to remove all of this stuff. Hopefully that will go a little better and it'll be a little more straightforward. Fingers crossed, everybody. All right, so after all of that, I've done not much. I got this wall panel off and I got the top panel off here. Looks like before I can move forward with getting this part off, I'm gonna have to remove the cabinet underneath. Hopefully that will go a lot better than removing the sink because if you notice, the sink is still there. But I wanna show you this because this is insane. Look at all these staples. There's a staple, there's a staple, there's a staple, there's a staple. There are staples everywhere. Everywhere. Who knew that this was gonna be the hard part? But today's the day, this is gonna happen. I swear. Hair is going up already. Let's get after these suckers. One. <laughs> They're too narrow. But these are the ones I need. Can I beat the crap out of it? Let's find out. Did you fall over? I'm not right-handed, so don't make fun of me when I miss. Okay, you're gonna stay right there and I'm gonna be more safe. Well, it worked a little. I don't know what to do. It's all staples. That's it. It's just staples. Should I cut it? Would that be crazy? Should I just cut it? That's all we're going to do. All right. So I went ahead and put on more protective gear because I don't trust what random things might be coming out of here. So there we go. Okay, that wasn't so bad. And my goggles are immediately foggy. Now that I have that broken, let's see if I can make a dent. Yes! Now I'll put my gloves back on. Where'd my other glove go? Another glove. Where are you? I took a water break a second ago. Because getting it wrong is exhausting. I think I can put my other goggles back on. Since they allow me to see, I got it! Woo! Her. Now I should be able to kind of rip this one out. Yes! So now we're just down to this wall. Hopefully I can go back to just unscrewing things. That would be nice. Man, if I can get this whole structure down today, I'm gonna take that as a win. Now, I'm gonna try to get this one off. And I'm just gonna keep going with beat the crap out of it. Beat the crap out of it works. Now, I'm gonna try to unscrew some things. That's why these screws weren't coming out. They're not real screws. What the hell kind of, what is that? Okay, I'll have to see this. What is that? That's not a regular screw. No wonder my screwdriver was being all weird. Everything is horrible. Nothing works. I suck at life. <laughs> May just be another beat the crap out of it moment. like this wood. It still has some of the bark on it. That's pretty cool. All right, well, this is a real screw. I was wrong! When in doubt, beat the crap out of it. Yank it, beat it, pull it, push it. I mean, this seems to be the way to go when you don't care about salvaging much of the wood. I just don't think that demo and salvage are in my skill set at the same time. Okay, that wood might just live there now. See, here's the thing, when you don't know what you're doing, you just kind of work until you can't anymore and just move on to a different area. Sometimes I've 
learned so far that doing other work ends up making your first work easier. So maybe if I get rid of this, then suddenly it will become much easier to get rid of this. Holy moly, you hear that? That's the sound of the wall breaking. Well. Here's the thing, I'm not really sure what to do considering that I don't trust this ground at all. Look, I just grabbed part of the floor. That's not good. Don't know how to get some of this stuff off. So I'm just gonna kinda take a break, clear my mind and reapproach it in a little bit. See you in about five or 10 minutes or 15, I don't know. All right, so the next thing I think I'm gonna do is take on the cabinets. Again, I'm nervous about this because of the floor. I'm gonna do the best I can. Um, I can at least get one board over here maybe. There's a good cross section right here. Uh, this is frame and this is frame. And then I'm gonna try to get this cabinet out. I really hope that it's not as difficult as the sink. You would think demo would be easy. So far, beat the crap out of it has worked in a lot of occasions, but I'm not sure if it's gonna work here. So wish me luck. We're gonna try this out. Here we go. <laughs> All right, moment of truth. Please have some stinking screws to unscrew. You're not gonna, are you? All right, when in doubt, beat the crap out of it. I know, y'all can't see anything right now. Well, I guess that'll do. At least I feel like I can see a little better. Okay, I need to be way more careful. That's good. That's another one of those crappy screws. I think I might not have been filming. Just in case, I've been working on getting this piece off, and then I decided that maybe getting this piece off would help me get this one off, because I could have some more leverage. I couldn't get my hammer under there, because this wall comes outward. I thought maybe I could kind of bang my screwdriver in there, and what ended up happening is this part started lowering, which is also good. Now my goal is to get this little piece off, and then maybe I'll be able to see a little bit better inside the cabinet part to figure out the best way to remove it. And All right, so I got that cabinet out. Still have that one to go. I learned nothing from the previous cabinet that will help me on this cabinet. I basically just kept ripping things out. All right, so I'm gonna switch gears for just a little bit. I'm gonna go ahead and take out the window frames here. I just need a break from the, from the cabinets. So once again, I am not going to be taking out the fiberglass. That will be on my cleaning day. For now, we got a wall panel off. All of this work today has been to try to be able to remove wall panels. That's awesome. Should I go for the cabinet now? Yeah. So this is the part of the day where I'm exhausted. I got most of what I wanted to do today done. Cabinets are down, the wall on the side is down, but this is the part of the day where I am working on my motivation because again, I am exhausted. That was a lot of really hard work. I've been here for about 
three and a half hours. My goal was four hours. I know that even if I leave now, I'll be proud of the work that I did today. I'm just trying to gather up the motivation to do that last little bit so that I can get to a good, you know, stopping place where I actually completed something rather than just making progress. So I'm gonna take a little bit longer of a break and I will either finish that part or I'll see you tomorrow. By the way, I made money today. Yeah, so we got some pretty cool, uh, cool coins here and a quarter and what I believe used to be a penny. I made money! All right, it's official. I have reached my breaking point. I did try to take out some of it, but that took forever. And the video that I took wasn't even pointing at that section. <laughs> so clearly, I should not be working around uh, anything dangerous right now. I'm too tired. And when I started today, there were two cabinets. There was a shelf. Uh, there was a wall here. I got it all out. I got this whole panel out here. I'm pretty proud. So when I come back refreshed, I am going to take this ceiling panel out. Also, if my dad either lets me use his truck or is here, then I'm gonna get rid of, for now, all of this stuff that I don't need. Tomorrow's goal is just to finish up this area and maybe um, get this stuff cleared out. We shall see, but for now, good night. Mm -hmm.